wonderful colt goes in the Queen Anne. What a start to the week. Frankel unbeaten in 11 starts, six of them group ones, the highest rated horse in the world. Will this be another big win? Last one goes in. There's Tom Queerty. They're set for the Queen Anne. Stand by. They're off. And a pretty good start too. Premier Loco on the near side began well. Going fast in the early stages too is worth that. Right over on the far side with the nose band. He's looking around there. Ian Mongan on bullet train. He's looking to see where the others are. He's the pacemaker for Frankel. And Frankel right in his slipstream there in the pink cap in about fourth position. Going into second in the early stages is, is, uh, is Joseph O'Brien and Acceleration. So on settling down and it's bullet train who shows the way from helmet and Acceleration and a half length away Frankel who's smothered up in the centre. Three parts away then worth that. Further back in the field then the black cap of side glance. They're followed next by Premier Loco and Red Jazz and right out the back is Windsor Palace in company there with Strong Suit who's second last in Indomito as last as they race up towards halfway in the Queen Anne. And it's Bullet Train taking them along to good gallop from in second, helmet on the near side. Over on the far side in third then the purple jacket of Joseph O'Brien on acceleration. Then in the centre is Frankel and now Queerly has given him a bit more rain as he moves up now with three furlongs left to travel. He says, go on, Frankel. Frankel races now to a narrow lead. Acceleration trying to go with him. The old rival. And they've got two furlongs left to go in the Queen Anne. And now he starts to shake the reins at Frankel. He gets an immediate response. The champion starts to draw away. He's gone three lengths in front. Acceleration can find no more. And this is a procession. It's now Frankel who's drawing away. What a performance. The superb the spectacular Frankel, 11 out of 11, and in a zone of his own, it's Frankel who wins it by eight lengths. Acceleration gets second, in third then is Side Glance, followed by Indomito, who ran on well. They were followed then by Windsor Castle, Castle back in the field. So too was Helmut in company there with Bullet Train, and uh, further back then Red Jazz. Back towards the rear was Premier Loco and company with Worth That, and also Strong Suit. But what a
crazy horse. Everybody's allowed to have an opinion. But I would very be surprised there's ever been a better racehorse in history racing. Thank you very much, sir.